All right, we, we recording? Yes, yeah, sir. All right, how y'all doing today? Good morning, good morning, good morning. You already know what the fuck going on, birds out here. We're about to get it started, just like that. Hey, today we're going to talk about, <clears throat> we're going to talk about, uh, what's the nigga name? Lucifer? And we're going to talk about Aramon. So let me go ahead and break this shit down to y'all so y'all can know. And y'all so can, so can really know what the fuck, like, this whole spiritual stuff really is. Um... So then, so let me let me go. Let me start with Lucifer. Lucifer, right? Everybody want to paint this bad image of Lucifer, like 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 this man really like motivating y'all to to really be out here stepping on bitches. Nah, Lucifer ain't doing none of that shit. Y'all doing that shit, y'all damn self. This is what Lucifer. Lucifer is the being that stayed back so y'all can have knowledge in the night, so y'all don't completely you lose yourself to Aramon. That's what Aramon is. So let me go ahead. That's what Lucifer is. Let me go ahead and break down Aramon. Aramon is pretty much when you okay. When you're in your spiritual journey, right? Your first your first awakening state. Your first awakening state when you first enter the shadow realm. The shadow realm is when Aramon have control over you. Okay? So so Aramon, so when you're in the shadow state and you with Aramon, you pretty much like, you know what I'm saying? And if you're not thinking about, hold on, so I'm going to get to that part. But when you're in a shadow state and you're, and you're pretty much like uh, chilling with Aramon, uh, that nigga is pretty much, he you pretty much getting like, you pretty much just, you're not thinking about like mankind pretty much. You know what I'm saying? Like you're not thinking about bettering nobody, bro. You chasing a bag. You ain't worried about that shit. You ain't worried about these birds. You ain't worried about the clouds, nigga. Y'all ass trying to get paid. That's what Aramon is. Aramon just give you the energy to keep on. To just focus on a bad breath say fuck everything else you know what i'm saying just say fuck it bro really say fuck that shit these niggas ain't shit bro i would bro when armai had his hold on me i was i was really like fuck everybody bro i was dead ass i was like fuck everybody oh god nigga get whack i don't give a fuck nigga i was out here with the glock we're gonna play with me see a lot of folks, a lot of folks who be giving y'all this spiritual knowledge don't even be from the streets. A lot of folks who give who be giving y'all this spiritual knowledge don't even, you know what I'm saying, never even done shit in life. They just want to talk about spirituality. Like, let me, they don't even tell you about the bad or the good shit that really come along with it. Because after I got out of Aramon, after, after I got out of Aramon, I literally, like, bro, my whole fucking life changed. I was controlling the elements. I was doing fucking everything. Clouds, st showing pictures of cartoons in the, in the sky and shit. Do your clouds, do your clouds show cartoons? I don't fucking think so. I don't, I don't fucking think so. Fuck talking about Oxy Gang in the building. Go ahead, drop a like. We about to get this shit started. <laughs> I just want to drop this video right quick so y'all can see this shit. So y'all can really get it. But yeah. So that nigga, so that nigga Aramon is basically when when a being is in a shadow state. So so like what Lucifer the, the role Lucifer plays in our life is to give he's pretty much guiding us through this plane, this plane field, this this third dimensional plane field, it may seem like it may seem like he's guiding us to to go chase money and to like to greed. You know what I'm saying? But that's not really what it is. Lucifer just give you insight. He just give you insight on the on on who you really are and like not who you really are. He give you he give you the the ability to see past the present in the third dimension. If that makes sense. So basically. Let me break that down for people who don't understand. So basically, you know how like your visual. So if you only focusing on the bag, right? You won't you won't be able to think about like okay, uh, you won't you won't be you won't be thinking about like okay, I don't want I don't want to like harm this person to get to get money. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to harm any. You like you won't be thinking like that when you're when you're when you're with Aramon. But Lucifer will give you the ability to think like that. So this, and I'm not saying like like people people who be like Lucifer, nah, bro. The devil, the devil's the bad guy. Lucifer, that nigga just keep it 100 with you. You incorporate everything in the spiritual realm how you want to incorporate it. Yeah, 
Y'all niggas need to be more scared of the goddamn devil. <laughs> that nigga Lucifer ain't really that bad. <laughs> like I said, he only gives you, he gives you insight, my nigga. That's it. He don't fucking, he don't make you go do shit. I mean, you do what you want with the information. Like I said, everything you do in this, in this world is your choice. This is not no fucking like, Lucifer doesn't just make you do shit. Hold on, let me take these headphones off right quick. But yeah. So, the way, the way to conquer, the way, the way to like, get past Aramon is to pretty much find yourself, the, the, nah, let me, let me not call it Aramon. The way, the way to reconnect back to the light when you're in the shadow realm, when Aramon have control over you, you pretty much gotta find yourself, dog. That's really what I did, bro. I literally sat down behind the gas station I was trapping at and meditated. And I was like, what the fuck am I doing? I'm about to get in a whole shootout for no reason. Nah, that shit was not worth it. I had to get out that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Because, one, it wasn't even me. It wasn't even some niggas I was beefing with. It was some niggas that the niggas I was, I was rocking with at the time was beefing with. So I'm like, nigga, I'm about to get in a whole shootout and get a whole body because, because y'all niggas mad. Fuck that shit. So I was like, all right, bro, I'm going to just talk to y'all whenever I talk to y'all. And I got the fuck on, bro. It wasn't like I was on no pussy shit. I just used my fucking head. I was like, bro, I ain't about to catch no body over, over another nigga not knowing how to run his life. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't know how to communicate with a human being. That does not mean I got to fuck up my what I got going on in my life. And yes, I was with the shits, but I, I was with the shits, my nigga. I was with the fucking shits. These niggas know I was with the shits. That's but I but I had it like you have to have clear voice, bro. It's that it's that it's that ability to sit down and just think and just be like, bro, this is not what I want in my life. This is not what I really want to do. And this easier way to get a bag, y'all niggas, bro. I'm like, bro, you don't gotta fucking be selling no drugs. And that drug, I know selling drugs is fun. Well, it's fun to me. I know a lot of niggas be stressing the fuck out. That shit fun to fuck to me. I fucking love selling drugs. I would sell drugs all day if I want if if it was legal. If that shit was legal, nigga, I would sell drugs all day. Big whole far fucking pharmaceutical around this bitch. But yeah, the the reason why the reason why um the reason why we get to that state of our mind is because we fear that state. We before before you find out about our mind. You already program in your mind, I do not want to be in a state that's going to take away my will. Our mind doesn't take away your will. He just... What what the R, what our mind does is pretty much like, bro. You, you, have you ever seen people wear a jacket in the heat? Nigga, I can wear a jacket in the heat. I can wear a whole South Pole jacket. I can wear a whole North Pole jacket in the heat, nigga, and, and be and be cold as fuck. And be cold as fuck. I ain't even capping. Nigga, I'll be chilling up in that bitch. And I got I got the power look 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 look. look. Let me tell y'all something, bro. After you, after you get out that harmonic state of being in the shadow realm and your ass is thinking like, bro, all I got to do is get a bag, fuck everything else. And after you break out of that state and your ass is like, okay, all I got to do is get a bag, but this time I'm going to do it the right way because I got niggas to feed and I ain't trying to go to jail. It's 2021. Ain't nobody got time to be getting locked up, nigga. Oh, God, nobody got time to be getting locked up. Fuck, fuck you saying. So after all that shit, so after you make it after you make it through all that shit, pretty much Lucifer and Armand's gonna be in your life at the same time. That's the uh That's the second mystic state. I guess the first mystic state is just getting to the Armonic state. But after after you get after you get past that state, after you get past that state, the darkness and the light is with you constantly. So you're gonna have you're gonna have constant the darkness and the light. The second mystic state, I realized I actually got rid of my ego because I was like, why the fuck do I need an ego? Because I realized the ego was the one that put me in the harmonic state. So that's why I was like, all right, let me get rid of the ego. And maybe the R, because I was I was afraid of Armand. After after I seen the hold he had on me, bro, 
and how I was willing, how I started seeing niggas pixelated, and I was like, bruh, you don't want this shit to turn no video game, bruh, because your brain can turn this shit, or this whole shit into a fucking video game. And you'll really be starting, you'll really be seeing niggas like a, like a bag, like like a whole walking, you see niggas as a walking bag of money. I'm not even capping with you. Nigga, I ain't capping. <laughs> so after you, after you, after you realize, after after you get out that state of RMI and you just like, you know what I'm saying, you get rid of your ego because you like, damn, the ego put me in that state where we're like, damn, I just chasing a bag just so I can, you know what I'm saying? Because you're really a peaceful being, but you chasing a bag because because I don't know your mom complaining about the bills or. Uh, you need, you know what I'm saying? You just gotta feed yourself, to be honest. And they really force you out here to go do some fuck shit to feed yourself. And then they wanna get mad when you when you end up whacking a nigga. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Y'all set this system up for a reason. You just gotta know how to move right, bro. That's a whole reason why I started doing this YouTube shit. A nigga started moving right. But what? Bro, I was, niggas too deep in the streets. Bro, get out the street, bro. Listen, listen, to, listen, listen to me, twin. <laughs> Hold on, let me talk to my street niggas right quick. Listen to me, twin. That shit ain't, bro. Yo, if you ain't door dashing and selling drugs, get out the fucking streets. I'm just, I'm just let let you know that right now. If you ain't, if you ain't door dashing and selling drugs, get out the streets. Cause at least, at least, at least when you're door dashing, you doing that shit a smart way, and you ain't getting caught up because you don't, you don't got no niggas around you. You know what I'm saying? No niggas around you telling you to do some dumb shit. So yeah, if if you do choose to do that, I'll just yeah, you know what I'm saying. Don't even, nigga. I, and I'm not saying the streets bad. I'm, I'm not saying I, ain't, you know what I'm saying. Like like nigga, you can make money. You can make money. Make your money, nigga. I ain't I ain't tripping. I'm just saying, nigga. It's the people you hanging around. Make sure you don't got no harmonic powers around you. Cause what I did was to get my harmonic teacher. I actually summon up. I used to I used I used shadow magic to summon up my first harmonic teacher. That nigga, I thought he was he did teach me though. No cap, like he really did. That like, like the nigga like he taught me how to be in that state. He said, "Hey twin, just listen to this music, bro. This music, cause literally, bro, I'm trying to tell y'all niggas that music shit puts you in that harmonic state. It really does. That music shit will make you want to do a whole lot of shit you know you shouldn't be doing." He said that nigga with that nigga like like dead ass that nigga told me, bro, just listen to the music, dog, and your ass gonna be straight. I was like, oh hell nah. But at the time I ain't say, oh hell nah. He was right. I'm just saying though. So like y'all gotta watch that music y'all be listening to, cause that shit can put you in harmonic state, make you only think about and it's kinda like let me break down this harmonic state so so niggas don't be like, oh that shit bad. That harmonic state is not bad, nigga. Being able to regulate your body heat when you're outside in the heat is not bad. Being able to have a constant stream, a, a constant connection with your goals is not bad. Being able to, being able to fucking goddamn go ultra instinct when you have to, my nigga, and really turn up when you have to is not bad. And really protect your being is not bad at all. That's why I have I did not get rid of the Armonic state. I kept the Armonic and I just used Lucifer. I have my mind in the, I still have my mind in the harmonic state. I'm using Lucifer clear voice in the harmonic state so I don't go around doing some fuck shit. You know what I'm saying? That's the key. Use use the knowledge. Use use knowledge in the harmonic state to maintain a con to maintain pretty much a godlike being, pretty much. They, ain't shit, trust me, ain't shit touching the harmonic state, bro. If a nigga's in the harmonic state and he's doing anything, bro, trust and believe that nigga gonna be doing that shit A1 and 100, 110 and above on God, I promise you. Nigga, they keep us, the government want us. I'm not even gonna speak on the government. They want us to be in an harmonic state because it's an infinite source of energy, dog. It really is. So keep in mind, you got a nigga, you got a nigga, you got a nigga that's only thinking about a bad, right? 
only thinking about a bag. He ain't thinking about eating. He ain't thinking about taking no breaks. He ain't thinking about nothing. Just think about a bag. That's what they want y'all to do. They want y'all to keep on working, nigga. They, you think they want to give y'all breaks? Hey, come on, bro. They want niggas out here doing stupid shit. On God. Nigga, if you get caught up in some stupid shit because the government... One, what I realize is, bro, just because these niggas set up a system for your ass doesn't mean you got to fucking go by the system and go by the way they want you to play it. Nigga, they got this. They got YouTube for these, for these, for these, for these, for these niggas and not in the streets, nigga. I said, all right. I said, all right. <laughs> Who the fuck I look like killing myself in the street, nigga? I'm about to go get this easy ass bag. Fuck you talking about? 